Welcome back to Sleeping Eevee. Um, today we're going to bring you probably a short video. Yeah. Um, we're going to be opening some of these Empoleon V tins. Um, I think you went and picked them up, what, few, like a week or two ago? I think it was like a week ago. Um, our Target restocked and I just went and grabbed these. I hadn't opened the Empoleon tins yet. Um, so we got two of them and they have a... Uh, uh, two battle stabs in them, Darkness Ablaze, Sword and Shield Base, and Celestial Storm. Uh, Celestial Storm is awesome because Celestial Storm, number one card is this Rayquaza uh, Rainbow Rare. Rayquaza GX Rainbow Rare. And I mean, if people want to know a value on it, it's about 100 bucks. Maybe I think it's like 110 bucks somewhere around there. Last time I checked, it's been a while though. But it's definitely one of my favorite cards and one I'm excited for. When Evolving Skies comes out, because I'm a I'm a Rayquaza fan. I love Rayquaza. They haven't had a hyper rare since since Celestial Storm of Rayquaza. Oh yeah, that's true. Yeah. I, I mean, I got his amazing rare. I got a couple other. I got a, some Japanese card hit of Rayquazas, and um, I can't remember what else I got, but I got a few. So I'm like, I definitely want the shiny one at some point. <laughs> Two shiny ones. Um, there's a shiny, oh, the shining legends, and then there's a GX. Yeah. There's a GX shiny. Yeah, there's a GX shiny and hidden fates, and a shining legends baby shiny. That was uh, sick. Um, show them your cards that you got. You picked up some, or you found a card and you got a card. This so this week, I was able. Here, Kyle, will show this up. Uh, I was able to get this off of eBay. Uh, 9.5 graded Noibat. This is my first graded card ever. And I was so excited because I don't have a shiny Noibat. And that is just an amazing looking shiny. How much did you pay for it? I paid 20 for it. 20? That's yeah. not bad. And then you also found, actually, what, yesterday? Yep. And one of the three packs I, that I picked up at Barnes & Noble, uh, I opened the three pack and found the Caitlyn uh, Full Art. That's pretty sick. I do like that card. That's I always like full art trainers. They just look cool. Um, so if you if you're in the hunt for Pokemon cards, you don't and you're having a hard time finding them. Some targets have been restocking because you mm -hmm. go all the time. But yep. Barnes and Noble sports cards and Pokemon cards. If you're yes. into both or one or the other, I mean, shoot, you can find any like they pretty much stay pretty stocked from what I can tell. I mean, I went a couple times. But you go all the time. There's a yep. there's a Barnes and Noble close to us that she goes to. She it's did. next to a GameStop and also near a different Target as well that's not close to us. And so sometimes we'll just check there to see if I have any luck. And oh. uh, we did open a couple of the partner packs. And I got this one out of out of a partner pack. And I actually had an error code, if you know what I mean. It had a, a solid green code card instead of like a green and white code card. So that cool. was cool. Blaine's looking is cool. Um, sorry we're holding a phone. Should probably explain that. Had some technical difficulties with our little stand. Yeah. Uh, so we're going to fix it. And I'm, I'm kind of in a hurry today because I got a, a fiance is coming back from her trip today. And I know I got to head home at some point. So mm -hmm. we're going to go ahead and get into this. I'm going to start with Battle Styles. I'm saving Celestial Storm for last. So okay. I'm hoping I'm hoping there's something good in Celestial Storm. Uh, all right. Here's the code card. And here's the code card for Empoleon B as well. Mm-hmm. Alright, one, two, three, four. Got an energy, energy recycler, girder, oh my bad. Cacturn, Galarian Slowpoke, put in the light, Yampert, Murkrow, Send Landit, Bell Sprout, I don't see Bell Sprout much, Esper, and a Cinescorch. I really like Cinescorch. I know it's a non hollow but I really like the Cinescorch cards. I know they use a lot of the same artwork in it, but Cinescorch is actually a pretty, pretty cool Pokemon. Uh, all right, Brady, your turn. Okay. I'll leave that right there. So there is the code card for that Apollyon. Nice. All right, and we'll do our first battle styles. I do actually want to say, well, you know, with the long skies coming out, I do want to make a prediction. <laughs> Now that Neuburn V card, I know that that has come out really uh, recently. The Batman Neuburn card. Yeah, you I like really, that. I really, really, really want that card. So we got Energy, BB, Heat More, Hero, Lickitung, Electabuzz, Esper, Timber, Galarian Slowpoke, 
a reverse hollow scroll of swirls and a Mr. Rhyme non hollow. Mr. Crime? Mr. Crime. <laughs> Pokemon Go fans. So the prediction I wanted to make, it pertains to a future holiday set at the end of the Sword and Shield uh, card. series. So I feel like there's going to be one more year of Sword and Shield set some cards and one more holiday set. And my prediction is completely off the wall, so I couldn't absolutely be wrong, is that there will be a Charizard in that last holiday set, and it's going to be an alternate art. Do you think it's going to be an alternate art? We had this conversation the other day. Esper, Timber, and I... I could see them doing that. One last uh, Charizard VMAX um, mm -hmm. for the end of the year, especially like a alternate art shiny or something like that. I don't know what it. I don't know what it would look like, but man, I could. I could see that. I could definitely see that. Maybe alternate art for all the original starters. That'd be kind of cool. That would be cool because they're doing that base set reprint in the holiday set. So I don't know what other Charizard they could do in the next year except for an alternate art. So they got Tool Jammer, Golbat, Gliscor, Glaring Mr. Ryan or Mr. Mime, Spiro, Zubat, Cubone, Reverse Hollow Bolton, and a Glaring Slow Grow. Nice. Darkness of Blaze is next. I haven't opened Darkness of Blaze in a minute. So uh, last time uh it's, I wanna say last time, but one of the last times we opened Darkness of Blaze, or you opened it. I don't already know what kind of card that is. <laughs> you found a Charizard. <laughs> Vmax. Yep. So I did find the Charizard Vmax out of this set. <laughs> yep. And I was definitely jealous because I literally started those packs. I've talked about that before. And I'm like, eh, I'm going to go with it. Well, she found a chunk of chew, not the, the regular Vmax, but uh, not the Rainbow Rare. But And I was like, man, I could have had those. I almost grabbed all the Darkness and Blaze too, but. Change my mystic. Oh, that's pretty cool. Galarian, uh, Mr. Rhyme, Reverse Hollow, mm. and a Swana Rare. I don't know if I, I don't have that one. So that's cool. I don't think I have that one. I don't know. Yeah. I don't open too much Darkness of Blaze. A few, few here and there. I think when Darkness of Blaze was still like kind of big, they champion like when Pokemon started becoming a thing, champion or like becoming hot. Let's just say not a thing. Oops. Yeah, Pokemon. Okay. Uh, Champions Path. Had just released too, so I was just after the rainbow rare and right. man, champions pass rough. Eventually, we're gonna do it though, we're gonna find it. Yep, and we'll pull. I mean, we're gonna open a lot of packs of that. <laughs> yeah, I'm hoping we find the Charizard. I want it to complete the set so bad. The all the VMAX Charizards, I don't, I mean, I'd buy it, but I don't want to buy it at the same time because right, it's something about pulling it. I don't know, it just it's just different, you know. All right, going into base sets, short the sword and shield. Where it's got those gold Zacian and Zamazenta cards. I do. And that hyper rare Marty. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Hopefully, I find something good. So we got fire energy. We got crushing hammer, man time, lucky egg, ghastly, Quadopus, Salandit, Joltic, Wooloo, Corvuscar, and a hollow. Berserk, Galarian Berserker. Pretty cool. It's pretty cool, actually. Mm -hmm. All right, we're down to Celestial Storm over here. You got your base set yep. next. I'm trying to get these cards. I can't even grab them. There we go. <laughs> and we still actually do have more base set packs to open. So it would be really cool for that Hyper and Marty. And we also have more Darkness Blaze and, you know, other stuff from these Sword, sword and Shield sets that were. Another code doing. card. Alright, good luck to you. We haven't really found anything yet, so <laughs> tins could be hit or miss. I usually have good luck with tins. Yep. But I, tins usually have something decent in them. Volpix, uh, Reverse Hollow Scaroopy, and, and a Selby V. Nice. That's pretty nice. I, I like forget that they had a Selby V in this set. Base set? Yeah. Yeah. That's cool. So Selby V, our big hit right now. I say that a little sarcastic. <laughs> I don't. I don't even want to. I hope it doesn't show the color. I don't even want to see the color. Okay. Okay. There we go. <laughs> is this four? Or it is four. Two. 
three, four. All right. X and Y is three. So they did I four. forget. So here's your energy. Energy recycle system. Marsh Stomp. I haven't seen that in a long time. Sableye. Slack off. Surskit. Slugma. Larvitar. Wishmer. Reverse Hollow Plus. Well, that's cool. And like that. a Hollow Delicati. I like Delicati. that Plusle card. That's pretty cool. I do like that Plusle card. That's pretty cool. I like that one a lot. I like that more than the Hollow. <laughs> <laughs> All right, your last Celestial Storm. We don't. Man, I, I don't know how much Celestial Storm's worth. Like a pack of it is. It's got to be worth a lot. I mean, probably. Right. Not real sure. Uh, haven't really checked on Celestial Storm. <laughs> Well, I don't open. I don't. I know I have opened too much. Right? I just got super lucky that day. I found that. I actually found that Rayquaza out of the tin. Uh, it was like a tag team tin. Or was it, uh, oh, I got a Torchic card. That's cool. And the Shuppet. I like the Shuppet. My nice. kit. Shrine of Punishment. Ooh. Ooh Bayonet GX. Full art. art. That's cool. That is a really cool that's card. That's cool. That's a that's a good hit right there. That's a good <laughs> hit. At least we ended on one. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's an awesome, awesome looking car. That is really cool. Anyways, it's a very short video today. Um, I don't know, Pokemon news wise, I don't know, if, I don't know of anything right now other the than- Pikachus. Oh, the Pikachus for the anniversary set. Yeah, yeah. they had the Venian Pikachus. They're releasing like all these different styles of Pikachus. There's gonna be a full art Pikachu um, from like the original base set. They redid it. Um, yeah, the same artist who created it who's also the same artist who created that base set Charizard, yeah. Mr. Hero Rita. Uh, he uh, went back and redid the artwork on his base set Pikachu card. That's cool. Yep. I know, so, I, I, I've seen some of the Pikachu. Like the, even the Vs look pretty good, but the full arts, oh my goodness. There's a VMAX surfing Pikachu full art. Mm -hmm. VMAX flying Pikachu full art. I love art. the surfing Pikachu. It's, I, I want to find the the original, even, even if it's out of uh, XY Evolutions, the secret rare. Serpent Pikachu. Man, I really like there, that card. There's that the anniversary set's gonna be so popular. If it, if you're not, if, I would o get some to open, mm -hmm. like a few, and then I would I would try to find like there's that gold Pikachu. Yeah, I want the gold full art Pikachu. Oh my gosh! But if you're if you're in it for the long run, like hold it for value, I would definitely definitely grab some and just keep it sealed. Yeah. Cause I mean, you I mean, you have you seen the prices of the last anniversary set? They're expensive. They're mm -hmm. expensive now. That was what five years ago. Yep, the celebration set. It's because uh, there's some really really beautiful looking cards in there. So I'm I'm excited for it. There's gonna be a, I mean Venus. I've seen what Venus or looks like. I think there's gonna be a base set base set Charizard, right? Yep. In that. So it's oh my gosh, I'm excited for it. I'm excited for for, the, for evolving skies as well. Um, I know they've already released the Japanese sets already released of that. Mm -hmm. And God, there's like two Rayquaza alternate arts. One sells for like two fifty, and the V Max one sells for like almost a thousand dollars right now. It may it's obviously gonna go down as more get found, but right. still, it's that's nutty. That's nutty. I can only imagine what the English version is gonna be like. How the prices on those they're gonna be crazy. But I don't have anything else. I I actually gotta go work on homework and, or go <laughs> meet my fiance at the house and then go. Uh, work on homework so you got um, anything else i have nothing else i know we have a uh, different openings of different sets through sword and shield we can do um we can go back open some more chilling rain i have more chilling rain too so. we'll, we'll figure all that out later i'm not in the mindset to do that right now <laughs> i'm tired and i have weddings this week yeah and this upcoming week i'm trying to get homework done it's just stressful i'm stressed a little bit <laughs> but uh like, comment, subscribe if you enjoyed this. Definitely comment because we want to hear from you. We want to yeah. interact with you guys and, yeah. and and hear what you have to think about us. If there's anything we can improve on, obviously we know the lighting needs to be improved on and obviously get our stand fixed so it's not so <laughs> shaky. But uh, but definitely, definitely comment down below because we definitely want to hear from you. Um, but that's all I got. This is Sleeping Evie and, and good night. night.